hello guys welcome to mr legend crypto guys in this video we'll be taking a look at an all coin balancer currently trading above five dollars we have seen balancer drop three do in the bear market losing more than 69.8 percent of its value in the last one year what's in store for balancer in 2023 how high can balancer go in 2023 if we see it pumping up to the high side if this all coin starts dumping to goblin town are we going to take out the lows when we set in june 2022 when we saw it trading around the 3.62 dollar region in this video we'll be taking a look at the balancer us dollar price chart on a weekly time frame we'll be looking at key levels where balancer might face resistance if we're pumping to higher prices in 2023 we'll also be looking at balancer performance against bitcoin balancer's performance against ethereum and then we'll take a look at balancer's market cap there's a very very huge red flag right here in balancer's market cap we're taking a look at what happened right here where we saw the market cap going from as low as 35 million dollars in june 2022 pumping to as high as over $300 million. Right now, it still has a market cap of $248 million. Is this an all coin that we should be accumulating more in the bear market? We'll be talking about that and more in this video. But first, guys, when it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. And investment in knowledge pays the best interest. So if you want to make money long-term trading or investing in cryptocurrencies, if you want to get the latest crypto news, price predictions, and chart analysis, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Let's get down to business. One, two, three, four, all coins have had a terrible time in the last one year. We've seen the all coin market dump into Goblin Town. All coins lost so much value. But that's what you expect in the bear market. We've seen Balancer lose more than 69% of its value in the last one year. Even the last one month of 2022, we still saw it drop 11.3%. How high can Balancer go in 2023? You'll see the all coin market rallying to higher prices. And guys, if we keep dumping to Goblin Town, how low can we probably go? Key levels to pay attention to for Balancer in the bear market. First, the $3.73 region, the lowest we have gotten to in this bear market from the all time high that Balancer set in May 2021 when we saw this all coin trading around the $73.8 region. Balancer has been dumping to Goblin Town ever since losing more than 95 percent of its value in 406 days right now we're in the second phase of the bear market i believe we've gone through the hard part where we see balancer dropping really low very very quickly right now is the second phase of the bear market where we're getting ready for the next bull run where we we'll see reaccumulation happening so there's always a possibility we'll see balancer even taking out this low going lower than the 3.6 8 dollar region from the all-time high if we see balancer going lower than that we might even see it drop maybe to as low as two dollars all coins are very very volatile that way even if balancers gets to as low as the two dollar region it will still mean from the all-time high it is just down 98 percent from where we are currently trading right now for balancer to get to that two dollar region we'll have to see it drop an additional 60 percent which is very very possible Balancer's market cap is showing us some huge, huge red flags why that might happen and that might happen quickly than a lot of people expect. A lot of people are expecting the dump to be over. But guys, if we see an all coin rally in the market, if we see everything going as planned, everything is pumping to the moon, everything is dandy, guys, I will not be shocked to see Balancer pumping to higher prices. Yes, we have been dumping to Goblin Town. Yes, we are still in the bear market. But even in the bear market, we can get some pumps to the upside even though we don't want to get carried away if those pumps arrive. And that important level you want to pay attention to for balancer in the bear market as we're pumping to higher prices will be around the $7.90 region. If you take a look at what balancer has been doing in the past, we've caught some huge, huge bounce off that level. The last time we caught a bounce off that level, it led us to new all-time highs. And the first time we caught a bounce off that level, we saw balancer going up more than 353%. So right now, we are getting stuck below the $8 region. I will not be shocked to see us even get rejected when we come back to that $8 region. But if we are able to turn the $8 region from resistance to support, we might see balancer pumping to higher prices, even going above $10. And the next level where we might be getting some heavy, heavy resistance along the way might be when we get above $16. I still believe we can pump above $16 in the bear market. Guys, in the bear market, we can even see all coins giving us 200% pumps, 300% pumps, but nothing crazy like new all-time highs. From where Balancer is currently trading right now, for us to even go that high, we have to see this all coin return more than a 216% pump. 
And highest I think we'll see balance are going in 2023 without setting new all-time highs is we'll see a rally in the altcoin market that takes it up over 500 percent carrying it to as high as the 22 dollar region the last time we saw balancer trading around the 22 dollar region was in april 2022 since then we have not been able to trade above the 22 dollar region i'll not be shocked to see us attempt to break into the 22 dollar region before the end of 2023 but ultimately we are still in the bear market and the bear market for accumulation so if you see balance are pumping to higher prices or dumping the goblin time in the bear market, you want to be accumulating dollar cost averaging, getting ready for the next bull run. If you take a look at some details about balance in the last one year, we've seen this all coin go from as high as $21.75 to as low as the $3.65 region. We've seen balance out with a market cap of $248 million have a fully directed market cap of over $515 million. And total value locked in Balancer is around $1.5 billion. A maximum supply of 96 million tokens, and we have over 46 million of those tokens in circulation, which represents 48% of the maximum supply. Balancer is currently ranked 96 on coin market cap, with over 61,000 people having this all coin on their watch list. Why will you want to get some Balancer in the bear market, getting ready for the next bull run, and why will this on coin increase in value? Balancer is an automated market maker that was developed on the Ethereum blockchain and launched in March 2020. It was able to raise a $3 million seed round by placeholder and accomplix. Balancer functions as a self-balancing weighting portfolio, price sensor, and liquidity provider. It allows users to earn profit through its recently introduced token balance by contributing to the customizable liquidity pools. Where can you get some Balancer token in the bear market? If you want to get some, getting ready for the next bull run. You can get some of Balancer's token on Binance, on Coinbase Exchange, on Qcoin, on Kraken, on Bitfinex. And guys, anywhere you get your popular altcoin, you can get some Balancer tokens right there. If you take a look at Balancer performance against Bitcoin, it has been dumping to Goblin Town as expected. As all coins do that in the bear market, we see all coins slowly losing value against Bitcoin. And that happens because in the bear market, people are scared. People see all coins dumping to Goblin Town, they sell those all coins for some Bitcoin, thereby reading the value of those all coins and Bitcoin gaining value against those all coins. So we might see Balancer in 2023 for that dumping to Goblin Town against Bitcoin. That's expected in the bear market, but that's exactly when smart investors are accumulating, getting ready for the next bull run. From where Balancer is currently trading right now, it's down more than 90% from the all-time high. And for us to see it set new all-time lows, it will have to go down another 30 to 40%, which can happen very, very quickly. We might see Balancer lose around 40 to 50% of its value against both Bitcoin and Ethereum in the bear market. If you take a look at Balancer's market cap, we saw a sharp increase in the market cap that happened in July, where the market cap went up more than 962%. But if you take a look at Balancer's price, we didn't see a 962% increase in June 2022. This altcoin only went up 115% in the moon. You may be wondering, why did that happen? It's because we saw more Balancer token coming to circulation. And when we have more tokens coming to circulation, we see the market cap pumping to the moon, but we don't see a corresponding increase in price. That's why you want to be careful with this altcoin in the bear market. More tokens can come into circulation. We see Balancer's market cap dumping to Goblin Town, going back to the levels where we were in June. That will see Balancer dropping an additional 83% from where we are currently trading right now. What will happen to the price of Balancer if it's dropping 83% from where we are currently trading right now? Guys, we're going to see this all coin setting new all time lows, blasting below the $3.73 region. Even going below the $2 region, we'll see Balancer trading around the $1.42 region. And that can happen very, very quickly in the bear market. That might happen at some point in time in 2023. So guys, drop your thoughts in the comment section. How low do you think Balancer can go in 2023? If the bottom is in, how high do you think will pump? Do you think we can set new all-time highs before the end of the year? Do you think we'll set new all-time highs before the end of the year? If you're accumulating more Balancer, getting ready for the next bull run, are you done accumulating or you are still getting more in the bear market getting ready for the next bull run drop your thoughts about that in the comment section thank you for watching this video don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this turn on the post notifications to get notified anytime i drop a new video see you guys in my next video